YouTube, man, what's good with y'all, man? Your boy, none of the soul, none of the chosen one, none of the glow. What's good with y'all, bro? I'm at work right now, but I stepped out. I got to make this video, man. I got to talk about what's going on. I got to talk about, you know, what's been happening and what other, what other of my supporters have been telling me about what's been going on with their journey. It's been happening to me, too right people getting mad on you uh, at you right when you start retaining people are going to start getting mad at you for no reason i'm telling you guys this now and, and shout out to all the new subscribers by the way i know there's a lot of new people here if you don't know who i am my name is nana right i'm just a, i'm just a child of god trying to change the world for the better place to be a better place real talk right i'm spitting knowledge spitting game i'm 20 years young putting people onto game right putting youngins onto game even people older than me onto game that our sexual energy is very important to hold on to. You must cultivate your seed, guys. This is powerful. And if you're a woman watching me, shout out to you as well, right? Go celibate. You can do it. It makes you pure again. It makes you become, right, more feminine in your natural state. Because women are supposed to be feminine. Men are supposed to be masculine. That's just the divine order God intended it to be like. But that's besides the point. Let's talk about how people get mad at you. Right? I've been noticing women. some women get mad at you when you start retaining, fellas. I want you guys to really pay attention. You know, when you're out and about in public and stuff like that, some women going to give you that mean mug. They're going to mean mug you. Some men will mean mug you, right? People start to really, really hate on you. I'm on day. I think today I actually hit day 40. So I'm going to congratulate myself. Thank you, God, right? If you guys want to congratulate me, go ahead. You know, it, it, it don't matter if you do or not, if you don't. All I know is that I'm going strong. I'm putting in this work every single day. Women start to get mad at you when you can control yourself. I'm telling you, bro. I can't make this up. I was out. I was out in public. What was it? Two days ago, I think I went to the store. Uh, two days ago, with my I was with my cousin, the one y'all seen me play basketball with. You know, I was trying to get into the line, right? You know, and I was walking towards the line. And I seen this woman just give me the mean mug, right? She was like, like she just gave me that mean mug face. I'm like, what is going on? I didn't even. I, I don't even know you. <laughs> she just gave me that mean mug type of look, man. Like she was pissed off for some reason. I'm like, what's wrong with her? What's this attitude for? Her? Guys, it's going to happen to you, bro. Just be aware. Just be be prepared for people hating on you, being jealous, right? That you are, you know, bettering your life, bettering yourself. People can notice these things when you're becoming a better version of yourself, man. You know, I remember when I was being a bum. When I was a bum doing nothing with my life, women weren't giving me the mean mug, right? They really weren't. They weren't doing the things that they're doing now, right? You're going to either have a woman get mad at you or she's going to like you on this journey. People in general, they're going to get mad at you or they're going to be attracted to you. They're going to like you. as a, if, it's a, if it's a guy, he's going to want to be cool with you. He's going to want to be your friend. Or he's going to be mad and jealous of you. And he's going to talk about you and try to bring up things that don't even make sense, right? They're just going to hate. This is what happens, guys. Retention is really true, right? It's really, it's really real when it comes to these things right here, man. I think it's a spiritual thing, you know? It, it really is a spiritual thing. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section. What do you guys think this is? But I feel like it's really a spiritual thing when people are hating, when people are just getting mad at you for no reason. You know, this may be even family members. They start to lash out at you. You, even, you didn't even do nothing, but they're mad at you, bro. This is exactly what I'm talking about, man. You guys have been saying, Nana, why are random women... Sometimes they're just, you know, mad at me. Guys, those women ain't for you, right? The reason why they're mad at you is because you're doing something that, you know, most men they've dealt with can't do. <laughs> bro, that's, that's a, bro, that's a gem. Most women are with guys who can't self-control themselves, who don't have discipline. So when they come across a real man of God who's doing this, they start to hate on you. They get mad at you for being so disciplined. Right. You, you guys don't understand what they're trying to do to masculinity. They're trying to literally tear it apart. This is why they want you to watch corn. They want you to sit there and chase tail all day, chase women all day. Here, I can care less about what a woman got to say or what another man got to say. I can care less. If people are hating on you, just know you're doing the right thing, guys. Just know you're putting in that work. You're blowing up. You're glowing up. Right? I've came a long way from where I, where I used to be, man. Where I used to be ain't the place I'm at now. God really has done a work, done some major work on me, bro. I've had to go through so many things to get to where I'm at. 
you know, not just, you know, physically, but obviously spiritually, mentally, emotionally. I've, I've gone through so many things just to make it here, bro. It ain't easy, man. If you're trying to break curses, it's not easy. Generational curses, it's not easy to break, man. Especially when you're the one doing it. Guys, it's not easy. It's not, it's not, it's not something that you just be like, oh, okay, anybody can do it. Nah, if anybody, if everybody could do it, they will do it. If I, if everybody could be on retention, they will do it. But not everybody has self-discipline. Not everybody can control themselves. Not everybody has what it takes to, you know, stop watching corn. They can't control themselves. It, it's tough. I know, guys, I used to be there. But it only comes down to who's really wanting it that bad, bro. Who really wants to become that best version that bad? Who really wants to succeed that bad? Who really wants to have a better relationship with God that bad? Right? You, you know, if, if you really want it, you're going to do what it takes, man. I'm telling you guys, retain, bro. But at the same time, you're going to get attraction. You know, we always talk about the attraction. We do. But guys, let's start to realize how people get mad at you. People start to envy you. Jealousy is, 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 is there as well. Just because you're doing the right thing, bro, people don't like that, man. You know, especially when they when they can't do it, they're going to hate on it. When you're different, people going to hate on you. It all comes with it, man. It all comes with being somebody that has a lot of power. Okay? You, you're holding on to your, your energy, your life force. Of course you have power, guys. This ain't, this ain't nothing new. We know this by now, bro. We know how powerful this journey really is, man. You know, I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep retaining because it's making my life better, bro. It really, really is, man. You know, I don't know where I'll be without it. I don't know where I'll be without God and just knowing about how to hold on to my sexual energy. Just discipline, right? And when it comes down to getting women, guys, it's not hard anymore. It really isn't. You know, I feel like I can get any woman I want. I don't care how she looks. That's how I feel because I know who I am. You know, this, this self-worth right god has has put that upon me right for me to know that hey you know you have what it takes to get any girl you want fellas remember that bro you really can if you're on this journey bro and you're putting in work you're not a bum you can get any woman you want it ain't hard just work on yourself grind focus on your career focus on getting money focus on god and realize that you can get any woman you want bro i don't care if she's a 10 out of 10 15 out of 10 i don't care about none of that i can get any woman i want that's how i feel but that's besides the point, man. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section about this video, bro. People are gonna get mad at you, dog. People are gonna hate just because you're on retention, man. They're gonna hate, bro. I'm telling you, they're gonna hate. You're gonna see it for yourself. You're gonna see it inside. Like it's like you know when you have the spirit of discernment, you're just gonna know people are hating on you, right? You're just gonna feel it from them. They're hating. They're 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 real life hating on the fact that you are just becoming the best your best self, and they're not. Right, you are doing something with your life and they're not. I'm telling you guys, this can be family, this can be co-workers, this can be people you've probably never even met in real life. They just gonna be hating on you, dog. They're gonna get mad at you that you doing something for yourself, man. That's what it comes from. I feel like people who do that that hate and stuff, they just hate themselves, to be honest. Right? They, 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 they don't like something about themselves, so they're trying to hate on you. Right? They don't like the way they live in their life, so they try to hate on you, guys. Don't fall for it, man. Don't try to put your mood down. Don't let them get you down. Don't let them get you sad and all that. Man, no. Keep going. I'm going to keep doing me, bro. You know, nobody can tell me nothing. You know, the work I've had to put in to get here, man, bro, it's, 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 it's beyond what some people can probably handle. Right? What, what, you know, it's the, the, toughest, the toughest battles are given to God's toughest warriors, man. That's a fact. Because most people would have been quit. The things I've gone through or the things you have probably gone through, some people, if they've gone, if they go through that, they will give it all away. They will quit. But just because, you know, God has, you know, elected you, God has chose you to do this. That is why you are still going with it. Bro, if I, bro, if God didn't put this purpose within me, right, if, if, if I wasn't chosen for a time like this, I would have been quit. But I know exactly what I'm supposed to be doing. I know the purpose and the calling on my life. So there's no such thing as quitting. Understand what I just said, guys. Some people can't, you know, fathom some things people go through. The things I've probably went through, the next man won't want to go through that. Or he, even if he goes through it, he's going to quit. He's not going to keep going. No. We, we built different, bro. Let me see it in the comment section. Say, no, 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 soul, I'm built different, bro. We built different, bro. We retaining. 
Ain't no, bro. It's like we're, we're like two percent, one percent, one percent, two percent of of men retain it. Real talk, real talk, man. It's not a lot of people doing this, bro. You know, and shout out to shout out to my coworkers, bro. You know, they did find my channel. Shout out to y'all, bro. Y'all see, y'all been seeing me on recommendeds and all that. Shout out to y'all, bro. Appreciate the love, appreciate the support, all of y'all, man. Let's keep it going. Let's keep talking about this 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 powerful energy. Let's keep talking about God and how our lives can get better, man. This self improvement never stops. I can't wait to hit a year, bro. I can't wait to hit these high streets again, so y'all can understand that I'm really does it. I I, re, I said I'm really I really does this. <laughs> None of the soul really does this, man. I'm here to tell y'all, bro. I really, really does this, man. But I love you guys. Comment down below what y'all think. Is this fast or cap? Let me know. I love y'all. Let me know what y'all want to see next. And I'm out. Peace.